So if you couldn't tell by the content that I'm putting out on my channel, it's that I'm a big fan of pilot gameplay in Titanfall. You know, the wall running, the going super fast as fuck, the hip firing, the double jumping, all that stuff. It's so, it's just so amazing. Like, nothing compares to it. I've always, always, always been a fan of the reflex-based uh, gameplay over the strategizing, intelligent, mechanic, uh, exploiting gameplay that... Other games require you to know how to do. D j that, but yeah, that's just that's just not what I that's just not what I'm attracted to. And pilot and pilot gameplay is just so amazing. It's just it, nothing compares to it. Again, absolutely nothing. I love going so fast, and it's just it just feels so rewarding knowing that I can think faster and shoot my gun faster that faster than any other player in the game. It's just it's amazing. But and uh, I, I and as well as me being a pilot oriented player is uh, what will what will call this group of people that we're talking about today. Uh, just like how I'm a pilot oriented player, I am friends with a bunch of other players who may also be considered pilot oriented players with their gameplay. And when you're with as many friends as these pilot oriented players as I am. <laughs> You begin to notice a pattern, so to speak, uh, within their given personalities. Uh, <laughs> it's and it's it's a pretty distinguishable distinguishable um, trait. Uh, it's it's it becomes clear as day the more friends with pilot means you become, and that is that what you you generally tend to see is that. People who play pilots are just so incredibly arrogant. Their egos are just off the charts. And I'm no exception to this either, by the way. Yeah, whenever I talk about... Just whenever I'm talking about uh, the personality of pilot-oriented players, just assume I'm also talking about myself as well. I'm also adding myself into this bracket. I'm not going to deny that. I'm an egotistical pilot. -y. But... Back to the matter at hand, pilots are just, pi people who play pilots, they're just so unimaginably arrogant, and I actually discussed this in a, a video uh, a couple days ago, my top 10 most annoying players, I actually put pilot means as the most annoying people ever, and I still stand by that decision. It's just, <laughs> it, it, it gets so old hearing about how this person is the best pilot ever. This person is the best person. Like, the, it's just, it's, it gets so old and annoying and repetitive. And I'm going, and I've always wondered, why is this? Like, hybrid players, people who play pilots and titans, they, they're not like this. Uh, people who play titans, they are, uh, I, I'm friends with a couple Titan mains as well. I don't see this at all. I've, I also watch a couple, I've also watched a couple videos by Titan players. And by looking at their personality, you can tell they're not that. They don't fit this egotistical stereotype either. So what, why is it? Why is this a pilot only thing? Well, that's what we're going to be discussing about today. Um, just exactly why pilot mains are this way. And hopefully I can try and clear up why. And I might have a pretty definitive answer as to the fact of the matter. But, yeah, let's get into this. Okay, so you're just going to have to bear with me on this one. I'm going off the script for this one like I do many of my videos. This is going to be speculation. But, so, right off the bat, the first thing I would like to point out that contributes to the overall attitude of your at typical pilot-oriented player is... Uh, a large majority of these people are older generation Titanfall players. And when I mean older generation, I don't mean like, oh yeah, Titanfall generation. No, I mean like actual like generation, generation Titanfall players, you know. Uh, I'd, like these are probably like the, probably the third wave of people to get into Titanfall, you know. You had the first wave of people, they were playing on Titanfall 1. Second wave were the pioneers of Titanfall 2. And then the, the, the third wave. A large majority of these people are, are third wave Titanfall players. We'll call them that. <laughs> Why not? And so what, what we find is that a lot of these new, 
the, this particular generation of Titanfall players were they prop they grew up playing this game, uh, watching people like well, Game Sager is the first person to come to mind, and and watching Game Sager, well, Game Sager is the literal definition of pilot of an egotistical pilot the, well not only is he the definition of an egotistical pilot but you could even in a way call game sager the father so to speak of modern of modern day pilot gameplay he practically pioneered all the mechanics well practically just slide hopping and that yeah and 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 air strafing that as well uh to help create what the gameplay that you see in many pilot mains uh today and a large majority of the pilot mains who fit into this category of egotistical they started off playing this game watching game sager and they saw how arrogant he was and a large majority of these people may have been kids in their impressionable years uh, which is a large time span, by the way. But, uh, but yeah, they may have been in, still in their impressionable years. They saw Game Sager. They just saw him being arrogant and being amazing at Titanfall. Uh, and they just they just must have picked that up along the way is what <laughs> is my speculation. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. You could see you 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 see a bunch of Game Sagery type qualities in a bunch of pilot mains, uh, but. We also need to understand that there are people out there who may have not have watched Game Sager, uh, but are still incredibly arrogant, which leads me to my next point. So, earlier on, I said pilot gameplay generally tends to be reflex-based, and Titan gameplay, um, I'm adding on, Titan gameplay tends to be um, thinking-based. Uh, and so, essentially, Titan is, Titans are strategizing, thinking smart, and pilot gameplay is about thinking fast, using superior reflexes. Uh, and yeah. Now, the thing about that is... What we generally find is that you can get smarter. Anyone can get smarter. Like, getting smarter is just... It's, it's a key point of life. You know, it's how we were able to evolve. So anyone can get smarter. But reflexes... There, there's, there are actually a couple studies to prove that you actually can't change your reflexes. Like, what you are given is what you got, and that's all you're going to have for the rest of your life. Like, you can't, like, maybe, there are some nitpicky things you can do to, like, slightly increase your reflexes, like, help tap into your potential. But, at the end of the day, the, the reflexes that you have, that's all you're going to get for the rest of your life. So, and what we need to understand is that, People who have superior reflexes, i.e. people who would be playing tight pilot game, no, not Titan, but people who would be playing pilot gameplay, they are going to probably be a little bit more cocky of the gift that they were given at birth, so to speak, maybe. And so, yeah, that's probably another reason why these pilot mains out here are probably so incredibly arrogant. Another thing, uh, so we all know pilot gameplay is ludicrously fast, like one of the fastest gameplays out on the market. The only gameplay out there that might be faster than Titanfall gameplay would probably be Smash, uh, Smash Bros, probably. Uh, that's, that's a, that's a big if, like, obviously the time to kill for Smash Bros is like, it's, it's much smaller than Titanfall, but... In regards to actually how fast, like physically how fast the characters move in Smash Bros, I think that might be the only game out there that has faster gameplay than Titanfall. Don't quote me on that, but that's just what I think. But yeah, Titanfall's up there for pretty ludicrously fast gameplay. Uh, and so what we need to understand is like getting this thrill, like we all know if if you if you if if you're a pilot player you all know what I'm talking about. You all know that thrill you get from going so incredibly fast. And that thrill, it's just such such an incredible adrenaline, adrenaline rush. It's just pure dopamine. And that is probably 
actually that might just be my second reason my second most important reason as to why pilot mains are so incredibly arrogant it's just you, you get you go you get that high off of going fast and you just think you're the best person in the goddamn world no one can beat you no one can touch you no one can even look at you how dare anyone look at you you should just cut out your eyeballs with an ice cream scooper and just feed them to your dog if you even think about looking at me <laughs> We all know that feeling. I get it. And so, yeah, that's uh, that's practically that's practically my speculation. That's uh, as to why pilot mains are like this. Uh, if if any of you have any other reasons that I didn't list off, feel free to tell me down in the comment section below, or if you want to talk to me uh, in my Discord, feel free to join that Discord. By the way, link will be in the description below. I would love to have people join it. Feel free, yeah, feel free to message me if you have any other reasons as to why this is this phenomenon, we'll call it, happens. <laughs> but either way, I hope you guys all have a fantastic weekend. I will see you all around. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there and have fun in quarantine. Peace!